We have a discovery segment, and today we're going up close with Abigail Boajiwa Eniapam. Uh, she's a professional drummer. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm fine. You Fantastic. Too. I'm very well, thank you. Okay. Um, so, you're a drummer. Yeah. Why drums? Of all the things you could have <laughs> chosen, why drums? Okay, I would say it's a gift I had, so... That's the interest. At what point did you discover that it was a gift? Okay, when I was in GHS. Okay. Yeah. What happened? Uh, you see, the school drum, mm. uh, normal the big drum and the small snare drum. Okay. When the guys are playing, I, I, I was like, wow, I like it. I can play. So. Where, where would they be playing that you would notice? Is it school, like school, marching sound. So marching, okay. Yeah. All right, okay. So I, I gained that interest. Mm. I can. So one day they sacked school fees and... Fortunately you for were me, sent home for school fees? No, I wasn't. Okay. But the but guys were okay. sent okay. out for school fees. Okay. So fortunately for me, I had a chance. Ah. And I went to play. Okay. So I was really happy. So, okay, actually I attended my basic school at Lam mm, okay. So he, he composed a song mm. and he wanted to mix up with ladies. So when he saw the potential I was having, and he was like, okay, then I should be part of the video. Mm. Yeah. So he just told me, some rollings just for people to know this how I started yes. and that was, that was all. it yeah wow. so it just came so how far has this taken you where have you played what are some of the things you've done I've played a long like many places okay actually what are some of the highlights okay uh, the office of the president really yeah actually I'm in a what band too there? All female band, lipstick band. All female band. Yeah. Oh, you're part of the lipstick band. Yeah. Wow. I'm the drama in the Oh, I see. Band. <laughs> I see. Okay. So we, we, we've gone to places. We went to South Africa for the Ghana Fest. Um, women Empowerment mm. Program, mm. weddings, okay. engagements, but most were government programs. Yeah. That's where I've yeah, performed. Wow. And if you had talk show, okay. like, yeah. So... What you did okay, so you said you found this interest yeah. when you were around fifteen. Yes. Okay. What did you? What other plans did you have in mind of what you're going to do in the future before you discovered drums? Okay, I was like, I'll be a air hostess. Okay. In school. An air hostess. Yes. Wow. That was my That's plan. What you but to do. you see, when we are young, I want to be this. Yes. But well, as you are growing up. Yes. You see, the, you develop your real talents. Mm -hmm. So I saw this was my field. Mm -hmm. Then I just switched it. Fantastic. Yeah. Fantastic. No regrets? No. You really love it? I really loved it. What are some of the... Where would you like to play that you haven't yet played? Ooh. Okay, my, my plan is to tour the world. Okay. Bigger stages and okay. stuff. So any big events, any bigger events... For me to perform, I'll be very great. We're in March. It's basically a women's month. Yeah. And we, you know, um, I, want to, I want you to talk to me about the importance of women being comfortable to do whatever it is that they are passionate about. Okay. Yeah. Tie that in with women's empowerment generally. Okay. What I'll say is when you have something to do, you have a passion or a gift to do, though there will be some discouragement or people despising you and stuff, mm. but you being a woman, try, mm. force and do it more. Mm. Mm. Because if I had uh, this gift, though I had some challenges, but I, I knew what I was up to. Yeah. So I, I moved on and by God's grace, mm. that's where I am. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Do you find when you're in places, people are surprised that uh, women can actually do this. Do you get that sometimes? Yeah, yeah. At the beginning, tell us what happened at the beginning when you st when you started drumming, and then people began to uh, they they hear the drums, they're excited, and then they see it's a lady playing. What are, what were some of the reactions that you got? Okay, I remember I went for a show somewhere. I was a lady drummer, so the guys were playing and okay. So there were other male instrumentalists, yeah. but you were the the, the, drum, the drums, the only yeah. lady on the so I went to perform with them as a band. They were like, ah, she, she, she. <laughs> so all the, the concentration came on me. Yeah. And when, after I finished, one surprising thing I, I saw was the guys that were playing the drums, mm. they got down. 
Sister Mpacho Bowai. Yeah, Mbubi. It's in Ahobo. So that was like, it gave me more, more yeah, yeah. That wow. So they were surprised seeing mm. a lady playing drums like that. Yeah. yeah. Are there more, okay, so over the period since you started, yeah. have you seen that in that side of the industry grow where there are now more ladies getting involved actively professionally playing instruments yeah i've seen more mm. but for drumming experts we are just few You're not but many. the other instruments okay. I, I do see more okay and it's one thing i've realized or seen is some are afraid to shoot up that uh, the gift or talent yeah so what if, do you think causes that though why why well, it some depends on friends and family. If they do despise you or discourage you, mm. you can't move up. Yeah. Me per se, those who inspire me more, my family and friends. Okay. Yeah. So if like you have such people yeah. inspiring you, at least you move up. Mm. But if you don't get such, they'll keep on dumping you. Down. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So so I, I like the fact that you're talking about family and friends um, inspiring you. Yeah. Share with us how you felt, what it was like at home the first time your parents found out that you played drums. Because you were in school. Yeah. And you, you know, you started, you got attracted to it and started playing. What, were, what, was, the, what was the experience I, like? Actually, when they reacted? I developed the, the, I saw the gift when I went to school, though. Mm. So it was like, my mother, uh, previously, my mother used to sell condo, cassava dough, okay. and these vegetables. Mm. So when I see the guys play, I'm the type when I, I just see you play, I do my calculations in my head. This is how you chew your hand, your, your <laughs> leg and stuff. So she will be out selling and yeah. when she gets back home, I'll bring her some broomsticks. Then I'll be disturbing. You see, we have condo and cassava do. So yes. those are my thumbs. <laughs> yeah, and my leg will be on the ground. And yeah, so oh, that is how my mom was like, wow, I you see. like disturbing. So she saw that the more she talks, the more I do it. Yeah. And she just gave me the go ahead, okay? What did you use as your. As your uh, um, I just hit the ground. Uh, the kick. The drum. kick. Yes. Yeah. You just hit the, the ground then. And then you. My, so what was your snare? Because these are if the cassava <laughs> dough is your thumb and yeah. your thumb, which the, one were you using as a snare? My snare was the cassava dough and the uh, condo, mm. the table. The table was yeah, the was snare. my snare drum. <laughs> okay. And the vegetables too, the table was a bit up. Mm. So that was my high hat. Okay. And I'll just oh, wow. position myself I and <laughs> yeah, be playing. Fascinating. Fascinating. <laughs> so I want you to encourage a young lady um, who's watching us right now who has dreams, but she's been told that, please, that's only for boys. Only boys do yeah. this. What would you say to a, a young lady like that? Okay. For me, I've had the platform today and exhibiting my talent or telling people about yeah. my talent. What I'll tell the other ladies are, they shouldn't listen to people. Mm. They should follow their hearts. Any gift they have, mm. They should work on it. It's not easy for yeah. the start, but they should work on it and move up. No Thank matter you. what, they All should right. work on it and Thank move up. Thank you very much. We've been Thank speaking you with Abigail Abwaje in Yapam, and she's been showing us how she went into the journey of professional drumming. She's going to give us some exciting drums, uh, drum, drum um, expose for us to enjoy. Let's take a look at what she has for us. Abigail, take it away.
Hi, I hope you enjoyed the show. Do not forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share with your friends. This is Breakfast Daily on City TV. Join the Breakfast Daily team Monday through Fridays from 7:30 a.m. to 10. Join us for breakfast daily, only on City TV.